Hi, my name is Gabby. My name's Alyssa. We're from the Omaha's Henry Dorley Zoo and Aquarium. And today, we're here to teach you a little about sloth bears. Alyssa, I heard you know a lot about sloth bears. I love sloth bears. Would you like to hop over there and teach them a little about them? I would love to, let's go. All right, hi everyone. First, I would like to talk about the habitat that a sloth bear lives in. A habitat is a place where an animal lives. So behind me on the screen, I have four different habitats. I want you to say the letter of the habitat that you think a sloth bear lives in. All right, are you ready? First, we have A, B, C, or D. What do you think? Well, I have good news for you. If you said B, you were right. Sloth bears live in a forest habitat in Asia. Now you did so good with that. Everyone give yourselves a pat on the shoulder. You did amazing. So next, I wanna play a true false game with you. So I'm gonna say something about sloth bears and you have to decide if it's true or if it's false. So if you think it's true, I want you to give me a little dance party and give me the jazz hands. And if you think that it's false, then I want you to cross your arms and stamp your foot and look right at your TV, look right at me. So if you think it's true, jazz hands for true, cross your arms for false. All right, you ready? Our first statement about sloth bears is that sloth bears are missing their front two teeth on the top. Do you think that that's true or false? Well, if you're giving me a little dance party right now with your jazz hands, you're correct. Sloth bears are missing their front two top teeth and that's because they love to eat termites. So they'll stick their nose into the little termite burrows and they'll use that little hole in their teeth like a vacuum to slurp up all of the termites. <laughs> Can you guys practice <laughs> slurping up all the termites? Like a vacuum, like a sloth bear? <sighs> you did so good, that's amazing. All right, next one. Sloth bears carry their babies on their back. Do you think that that's true? Or do you think that that's false? What do you think? Well, if you're giving me jazz hands, then you're correct. Sloth bears do carry their babies on their backs. Look, aren't they adorable? They're a little fuzzy. Did you know they're the only types of bears that will routinely carry their babies on their back? That's super cool. All right, next fact. Sloth bears are carnivores. What do you think? Carnivores is an animal that only eats meat. Do you think sloth bears, true, they only eat meat? Or no, they eat other things. What do you think? Well, if you cross your arms and give a little stamp of your foot, you're correct. Sloth bears eat a lot of things besides meat. They're called omnivores, which means they eat plants and meat. So while they really like termites, they also like fruits and vegetables, and they love honey, too. I, li I like honey, too. Do you like honey? All right. Our next fact is that sloth bears are only awake at night, which is called nocturnal. What do you think? If you think that that's true, sloth bears are only ever awake at night. They always sleep during the day. Give me jazz hands. And if you think that sloth bears are awake at other times, then I want you to give me your best glare. Cross your arms, stamp your foot. What do you think? Well, if you are crossing your arms, then you are correct because sloth bears, they actually can change the times that they're awake based on if there's other bears around or if there are people around or if there's tigers around too because sloth bears, they really don't want to go around tigers. All right, I have our last fact. Are you ready? Our last fact is that sloth bears are called sloth bears because they're really slow. What do you think? True or false? Well, once again, if you're crossing your arms and stamping your foot, you are correct. Sloth bears are not called sloth bears because they're slow. While sloths might be really slow, that's not why. They, have, they both have these claws. Sloths have claws because they climb through the trees. 
in the rainforest. But sloth bears have claws to rip open termite nests. So here behind me, I have a picture of a termite mound and sloth bears will use those claws to rip it open. But the termite mound, they're really, really hard like cement. So if you go outside to your driveway or to your road and you try to, you know, hit it with your hand, that's how hard these termite mounds are. They're really, really hard. So they need those claws to rip them open to get all those juicy termites out. And also, if you look here in this picture, that's a picture of a termite. Do you think that would look good? I don't know. Sloth bears think those are tasty, though. Next, speaking of termites, Gabby has an activity for us with termites. Let's go back over there. Thank you, Liz, for all those super cool sloth bear facts. You're welcome. But you're talking about termites. And are termites super big? No, they're really, really small. Wait, how small? Really small. Like, like that. <laughs> like this? Like a singular grain of rice? Those are really, really tiny. Look how big that quarter looks in comparison to the rice. It's huge. How many termites do you think it fit on a quarter? I don't know. It seems like a lot. It does. wonder if you guys at home would be able to tell us. Well, it's now time for our at-home activity. Like before, we have posted some activities online, downloadable activity sheets for you guys to follow along with. But we're only going to do a few of these activities. And I actually changed one of the activities where it could be a race because I'm really competitive. Lisa, how do you think that sounds? I think I'm going to beat you. That sounds great. Hmm. I don't know. I'm really good at this activity. So I set up a station for us to do this race, but to get to the station, we have to walk like sloth bears. That sounds so amazing. let's get ready. All right, so sloth bears, they walk with their toes pointed in, and they use the same leg to walk forward at the same time. So sloth bear walk. <laughs> <laughs> Who's there? Interrupting cow. Interrupting cow. No! <laughs> <laughs> you can't keep the straight. 